Hello again, Andy with Handy Andy back again for the second phase of this particular bid. And you know, the funny story about this is while we've been dodging raindrops today, uh, we're over on Monroe Drive, uh, and Handy Andy started about 25 years ago, about a stone's throw away from here. We did a lot of houses in the Piedmont Park area in uh, downtown Decatur, and we got, we literally, it's funny, people know my story. I wanted my own company, and I was in commercial real estate, and uh, I had a really dear friend of mine who had a home here, and she had a plumber come out and do a bunch of work and cut all holes through her house, and then it left her for months because they had plaster walls, and the plumbers down here don't patch walls, so it was up to her to try and find someone to patch about 80 holes throughout her house, and no one wanted to do it, and so we got to talking, and I, I wanted to start my own business. So that literally was my first project at Handy Andy. And from there we grew to about 10 crews and uh, I kept my corporate job for about five or six years and then quit and did this full time ever since. So it's been nearly 25 years now. And so we're right back to about where we started. And uh, if you catch the other video, we started on the backside of this house. Parking down here is just a pain. And so we're looking at the front of the house. Uh, and one of the things you gotta maintain on these houses is you gotta cut this, you gotta start cutting the the trees away so we got to trim this back at the front left and front right and down on the right side the house all needs to be hand scraped here a few years ago somebody replaced this freeze board cap at the end of the, the porch here the second story next to the numbers and they didn't back prime it so as water leached in and the caulk failed it warped and rotted so we'll replace that piece again uh, we can't really see it very well um, but and you can see with all the water streaking this house used to have gutters on it it had saucer gutters when it was built believe it or not uh, and up in this corner up over here, we've got some rot in that fascia up there. Uh, all the siding on the front is in pretty good shape except for this right corner right here. It's starting to miss, so I'm gonna try and hurry. We gotta repair this right front corner board right here. The cap here at the base, the freeze board down here, and the drip cap on top of it's rotted all the way through. There's three rows of rotted siding right in here that go through. And the rest of this is pretty good. Um, this is a replacement window. Uh, more than likely it had these these nicer windows up here these 12 windows 12 panes uh, All this is in pretty decent shape except for trimming this out And then we swing around the corner the right side is where most of the damage is on the house You've got a ton of siding in this area right here to the above this first floor window right here There's four rows around this window that need to be replaced There's about I think eight rows in this area right here that need to be replaced between the window and this corner board and you can see where the animal's getting in up here. Uh, this wood was replaced before and it warped out because it's getting water. Without the gutters, the water's just dropping down the house. Uh, and that's another reason you need to create some vents down here to keep that moisture out. So we've got a few rows to replace in this corner right here. As you come around the inside corner of this bay, we've got about 11 or 12 or 13 rows right in this area right here that are rotted. The bay itself is pretty decent. When the guys start work, we might find a little more repair work in there. But this area back here is getting crushed because there's a valley right up here and so all the water just comes right here these trees are too close and need to be trimmed back but the, the siding between these two windows is completely shot out we've got a couple rows above and three or four rows below but once we get that all taken care of the house will be in pretty good shape if we can hand paint it and put it back to the way it was this is a beautiful home i'm andy with handy andy we've been out here a long long time we're at 770 9122829 see you at the next house bye for now